In chapter 14, obviously, we're going to go over human genetics. And I just want to let you know that chapter 14 is very similar to our previous chapter, chapter 11. And in chapter 11, remember, we went over Mendelian genetics. Uh, we learned all the neat vocab like homozygous, dominant, recessive. We did all of our Punnett squares. We learned about the law of segregation and the law of, of independent assortment. We're going to use those same concepts in this chapter as we look at how human traits are transmitted from parent to offspring. First thing we're going to talk about in this podcast is the chromosomes. And first we want to know is how many different kinds of chromosomes do humans have? And that would be 23. We have 23 different kinds of chromosomes. So how many total chromosomes do we have? And everybody should know this answer. It's 46. Why is it 46? Because you got 23 from one parent and 23 from the other parent. So a male sperm cell will have 23 chromosomes in it. A female ovum or egg cell will have 23. Put them together, 46. All right, so what are sex chromosomes? Sex chromosomes are the two chromosomes that will determine your gender. And they are named X and Y. Females have two X chromosomes. They got an X from mom, they got an X from dad. Males got the X from mom because mom can only give you X chromosomes and they got a Y from, a, from their father. So the basic rule is if you have a Y, you're a guy. So let's write that one down here. Okay. So a great way to remember this is have a Y, you're a guy. Great little mnemonic device. All right, now, the X chromosome is way larger than the Y chromosome. The X chromosome is basically a medium-sized chromosome, and the Y chromosome is one of your smallest. About 1,200 genes on the X chromosome and only about 140-ish on the Y. So you're talking, you know, that's less than 10% the size. Okay, what are autosomes? Sometimes these guys are referred to as autosomal chromosomes. Well, these are the other two, 22 chromosomes that are not sex chromosomes, all right? So you have 22 autosomes, and they get the name, they're named by number. The largest is the number ones. The smallest is the 22. The second biggest is the twos. The second smallest would be a 21, so on and so, so forth. Okay. Now, remember, we had 23 different kinds. We have 22 different autosomes, and then we have a pair or a set of sex chromosomes. So sometimes the sex chromosomes are not necessarily referred to as sex chromosomes, but they'll be called the 23rd pair. So remember, the 23rd pair, sex chromosomes, same difference. All right. That's the end of this first uh, podcast. The next one, obviously, is going to be on the karyotypes.